So the vanity metrics then become quite dangerous because you might be doing quite well in your in your vanity metrics, your views, your comments, your likes, but actually it's not getting to the people that are going to buy your product or services in the long run. So consider that your ideal client needs to be front and centre. Um, it might be that you go through a bit of a drought period with your metrics as a result. If you start posting for people who aren't yet in your audience, then the likelihood is your views and, and comments and likes and engagements are going to go down for a period of time. And that can feel like forever. Trust me, I've been there. Um, I went from retail to contact centers to content marketing. Those are three very different um, industries to speak to. And I've got a mix, an eclectic mix of all those people in my network. Some of them are useful for that, some of them aren't. I don't speak to everyone in my network in terms of my content. I speak to the people that I want to drive value for. So right now, you know, I'm talking to people who want to create content but don't have the time to create their own, don't know how to create their own, haven't got money to pay someone to create their own. They're all the people I want to talk to, and that's what I create content for. 